ओ माय गॉड ये रिमोट एग्जाम बुक तो कर लिया लेकिन ये मेरे सिस्टम पे होगा भी कि नहीं और ये सिस्टम टेस्ट वैसे से वालों ने बताया है ये कहां से करना है और कैसे करना है डू यू हैव दीज काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चन इन योर माइंड इफ यस देन यू हैव कम टू द राइट प्लेस सो स्टे ट्यून्ड okay so first of all this is how the screen will appear now don't worry about where to find this uh, i'll post the link in the description below so that you can find it easily first of all if you haven't still checked uh, whether your system is uh, like you know technically sound for your exam or not then you can click on this minimum technical requirements in full once you click on it this will download the document and it will look something like this in this document uh, there is everything that is uh, described in detail starting from the operating system uh, and then the firewalls the ram which require 4 gb of ram or more and then the display settings and then the supported internet browsers and you must have the up to date most up to date version of the browser and then the internet connection that you require minimum 3 mbps downloading and uploading speed and then there is the webcam requirements then the sound and microphone the browser settings the device that you can use and then the power source so you can check all uh, these minimum specifications in this document before you start this so once you've gone through this document this will ask you uh, the questions regarding the minimum specifications only so first of all there is a operating system uh, they have mentioned it why this is important because uh, they require genuine windows uh, to run the exam successfully so how to check agar aapko nahi pata hai ki isko kaise check karna hai unhone wo sab bhi yahan pe bataya hai then once you click on yes it will proceed further if you click on no it will say that the minimum technical uh, requirements have not been met go back and either change your system or like you know get these things fixed okay so if i click on yes it will take me to the next uh, condition that is the firewall all the or the vpn uh, then if i click on yes then the device okay so you have to uh, check on which device that you're using uh, for example if i'm using a laptop then uh, it will ask me what ram like i have uh, i should have minimum 4 gb of ram then is the display resolution it should be uh, 1024 into 768 then is browser okay so here's an important thing you should use the most up to date version of your browser because these softwares will run only in the most up to date browsers and if you don't know how to check it again here it's mentioned how you can check it then yes then it's the internet connection you require minimum 3 mbps for uh, this exam and tethering to a, a mobile hotspot is strictly prohibited so make sure you use a stable internet connection and you don't use the mobile hotspot then is the webcam resolution how to check and again mobile phones are strictly prohibited if you want to use an external device then use an external webcam but do not use the mobile phones then the microphone and the sound yes okay now we, uh, they have verified that you have all these uh, minimum specifications after this it will take us to the link where we have to check the minimum uh, our system this is how it will open we have to click on uh, the complete the system test once it opens you have to click on the copy access code it is copied then it will prompt you to download it you download it done it will take some time to download 
Okay, so while it's uh, downloading, another quick thing, make sure that you're performing this system test on the uh, same system that you're going to, use, uh, going to use in the exam, the same system, the same internet, for the obvious reasons, because if you're performing it on some other device, how will you get to know that uh, the system or the internet that you're going to use on the actual exam day works for you or not? So yeah, confirm that you're using the same thing. Okay, I guess it's downloaded now. Click on the uh, file that's downloaded. It will open uh, the OnView app. So it's automatically going to put uh, the access code that uh, we copied in the previous step. And then you have to click on the next. It will give you some warnings. You have just click on next. Okay, first it will check you the uh, check your microphone. Click on this. It will check your microphone, uh, the quality and whether it works. It's working. And then the speaker checks. It will play a sound for you. And if you can hear it, click on yes. And then the webcam check whether it's working or not. It's working and then click on next. It will take some time because uh, like, you know, maybe your network speed at present is a bit, little bit slow or whatever. So the network connections are checked, I guess. Okay, we got a green tick. then it will uh, launch, a, launch a simulation of uh, exam. Wait for it. Okay, so our exam is ready now. Just click on the next button. Uh, it will ask you to close down all the apps that are running because no other app can run while your exam is running. So how do you close any other app that's running? Uh, you just click on uh, the, any app, hover over it, and just click on this. Any other uh, apps that are open? Okay, and then click on Next. Launch the simulation. Okay, so our simulation exam is launched. It says, welcome, you have successfully launched a sample exam. And then uh, the next button will appear here and uh, it will take us to a question, sample question, just a formality to complete the simulation. Okay, you can see the next button now. Click on it. Okay, so the question is whether you should be using uh, the same system, space, computer and internet connection from which you'll be taking the actual exam. So yes, obviously. Click on true. Then click on next. So thank you. You have successfully completed the exam simulation. And then click on uh, end exam to return the setup. Okay, so that was all for the system test for the ECC remote exams. I hope you find this helpful. And if you do, please like, share and please subscribe to our channel so that you can get access to some more content like this. All the best.